What is up, guys? How the hell is everyone, man? God damn, it feels good to be back. You know, a lot of people talk shit over the years. Saying them this, trying to shut me down. Falsely reporting my shit. And let me tell you guys right now, when I said that this year was going to be my year, I fucking meant it. These people have held me back for far too long. And let me tell you right now, I'm about fucking sick of it, dude. All these people doing this shit for what? Because they want to run their mouths? Because they don't want to see me succeed? That's what these people want, man. They don't want to see me succeed. But I say this. Fuck those that don't want to see me succeed. Matter of fact, I got a song for that. This is your garbage trash browser, and this is Opera GX. <laughs> you see this difference? <laughs> Opera is 100% customized. But we're gonna do it like this. We're gonna do it like this right now to start this shit off. And this song was sent to me by a very good friend of mine. And a matter of fact, I think you guys might know this band. I think y'all might know this band, and if you don't, well, you're about to find out, ain't you? Let's get this started. How the fuck is everybody doing tonight, man? I see you motherfuckers watching right now. Post in the comments, man. Say what's up. How the fuck you guys doing tonight, man? You guys doing good? Now the reason why I chose that song to start us off is for a very important reason. Because I want to show all these doubters and all these people that want to see me fail and want to see me crumble, I want to show them that I cannot be broken that easily and I will not be shut down no matter what they say and no matter what they do, I will not be silenced. I will not give in to the hatred. I will not give in to the darkness that they try to provide and push upon me. You know, these last eight years have been a hell of a fucking fight. And for those of you that don't know, 
a couple years ago, thanks to some of these people who I will not mention anymore by name. Because of these people, I was put on the edge of suicide twice in a row. And I'll be honest, man, I'm sick and tired of losing friends. I'm sick and tired of losing people I care about because of these fucking people, man. I've watched too many friends walk out of my life. I've watched too many friends take their own lives. I've watched too many family members walk out of my life. And I can tell you this right now, for those of you that stuck around, I want to say thank you. Because you guys are the reason why I'm still here. The reason why I'm fucking fighting to this day. And I can honestly say that I'm glad to not be around that toxic environment known as YouTube anymore. And yes, the rumors are true. I did retire from YouTube indefinitely, if not for good. Because I knew that staying there, I would never get better. I had to leave the place that I love in order to get well. Because the place that I love started to turn toxic in a lot of ways. And I knew that if I stayed there, I was never going to get better. I knew damn well that if I stayed there, I wasn't going to get better. I was only going to get worse. And I am proud to say that I'm doing way better now than I was when I stayed there. I've had more time to work on music, more time to start thinking of new ideas for potential movies that I wanted to work on. And even new ideas for some artwork and some merch design for all of you guys that want to see me succeed. And like I said, for those of you that stuck around, I want to say thank you, man. You guys mean the motherfucking world to me and I fucking mean that. Whether you're old school fans from the site called You Now... Whether you're one of the thousands of fans from over there, or whether you're an old school fan from YouTube, Facebook, wherever, man. Wherever you guys are from, for all y'all that stuck by me, I want to say thank you, man. You guys are fucking badass. Because my goal is to not only build a community of fun, like-minded people that enjoy having fun, that have been through similar shit, my ultimate goal is to start fighting this terrorism that goes on on all the platforms. And I want to do that by starting an organization that is dedicated to helping people and providing the people with the resources that they need to be able to fight this shit. Because I know there's a lot of people out there that don't have those resources. And I want to be able to provide that for people like myself that go through this. I want to be able to be that voice. I want to be able to do that and give back to the people that have given to me all these years. I want to be able to give back to my community. I want to be able to give back to my people as much as I possibly can. Because let me tell you right now, I know I might not get paid right away. I know it might be a year or six months before things get back to normal. And I'm okay with that. But in the meantime, I'm going to continue to fight behind the scenes with you guys, my friends, my fans, and my family. I want you all to know right now that I love every single one of you guys very fucking much. 
you guys are fucking awesome. And without you guys, I wouldn't have had the courage to keep fighting all these years like I have. It's because of you guys that I've been able to come back and fight for what I love and fight for what I believe in. Because let me tell you something right now, man. No one deserves terrorism. No one deserves to be a target. No one deserves to be bullied the same way that I have over these last nine years. And that's why I want to give back to you guys. I want to show you guys who I was before all this. I want to show you guys the me that I was 10 years ago, 11 years ago, 12 years ago. I want to be that person again for you guys. Hang on, guys. Hang on. What? Sorry about that, guys. I take care of something real quick. But with that being said, I want to jump right into this next one for you guys. This next song is one that's very close to me. And here's the thing about the trolls, man. You guys will fall. Into a business. Eventually, the troll community will fall. You might not think it will, but trust me, in due time, it will fall. And when it does, that day will be a great day to celebrate. Because I will not be silenced anymore by you tyrannical fucking assholes. I will not acknowledge you no matter what you do. I will not name drop any of you anymore. Because you guys don't deserve the recognition. The only ones that deserve the recognition are my friends and the people that are helping me. They're the ones that deserve recognition. You guys, the troll community, deserve nothing. To me and to the rest of the world, the troll community is dead. But take note, I will not mourn the death of the troll community. I will celebrate its death and its demise. Hang on one sec guys, I'll be right back.
What's up, guys? I'm back. Jonathan. Had you guys dinner real quick, and I'm waiting for dinner to cool off. It is hot. Very, very hot. How do you like your burger, Green? Well done, please. I don't know if you could take those guys to cover the spread. The weather gets cold and they crumble. Yeah, not everyone can handle the elements. You know, I've never really bought into all that cold weather stuff. Really, Greeny? I'm always taking the cold weather teams. Especially in the playoffs. Can you flip mine? The great ones tough it out, regardless of the weather. I should have brought my mittens. It's 48 degrees. Yeah, but the wind is whipping off that lake. We're 30 miles from the lake. If you've been following me for a while, you will know that I love creating patterns, but I've been wanting to am- Hang on, guys. Alright, let's restart this. I would say right now to the two trolls that are watching, I don't care if you find me. Because I know in due time, you guys will be eradicated. And I will be left smiling. Because you will never beat me again. Because you seem to forget, Music Biz Marty is now on my side. And Marty is the king of the trolls. Or did you forget that? Marty is far more dangerous than you trolls ever could be. Haven't you ever heard the enemy of my enemy? is my friend and also the enemy of my enemy is my ally and yes me and marty may not be friends but he is my ally and trust when i say to the troll community you will crumble Beneath Marty's feet, my feet, and everybody that you've ever fucking attacked, I can promise you that. You will fail, and you will fall. In due time, trust and believe, you will fall. So you better accept it, because your reign is now. Your rent is coming quick, so you may as well accept it.
Now let's start this over here. Let's start off with something different, man. I want to dedicate this one to all my friends. And to everybody that has been trolled and harassed and bullied. I heard a knock upon my door. I want to dedicate this song that I'm about to do. For all my friends that have sadly lost their lives and are no longer with us. And I also want to dedicate this to every single victim out there that you trolls have gone after. Everybody that you have targeted and victimized. I want to dedicate this one to them. Question. Would you build a website for a major brand with more than 200 million users using Wix? Well, we God damn, it feels good to be free. It feels good to be away from the trolls. It feels good to not acknowledge scum. Opera GX is the best browser in the entire world. I've said that a million times now. I made the switch from Chrome to Opera a few years ago and I've never looked back. It is just far superior. It doesn't, you know, hog all your resources. I have my own mod in Opera GX, which changes the wallpaper. I want to dedicate. Like I said. You trolls might find me many times over, and that's fine. But never will you get in my head or stop me ever again. You guys say you're going to, but you're not. You guys are holding on to a dying way of life. Your way of life is over. Your way of life will fall. And that's not a threat. That is a promise. That is fact. That is reality. The reality is that you guys will fall. And let me say right now to the troll that's in the comments, bitch, you're first on my list. I'll make sure that you fall and crumble. You're first on my list. I'll make sure that you are shut down off of all social media for fucking good. Because it's scumbag little whores like you. That do nothing but run your faggot mouth. See, the lesson you fail to learn is this. Evil never prevails. You are a demon, and I am a demon slayer. What part of that do you not understand? I am the one that will destroy you and everyone you love. I will destroy you and the entire troll community along with you. And if you don't think I'm going to, try me. And you are a demon. And you know what happens to demons? They get sent back to hell where they belong. So I say this. Don't forget to shut the door when I send you back to hell.
bitch. Cause demons never prosper. Demons never win. And I say that not only to the person that was in the chat that I just banned, but I say that to everybody watching that enjoys my content. One thing I want you guys to remember, never give in to terrorism, never give in to demons, because these people are evil. No matter what they do, never give up, never give in, and never surrender to these people. They are terrorists, they are criminals, and they deserve to be treated like nothing more than the scum of the earth that they are. So to the troll community, I say this, you better prepare for war. Because I'm leading this fucking attack. But trust me, I say, this time, I'm not alone. I have backup. And every single one of my friends are coming after all of you. It's only a matter of time. So if I was you guys, I'd say my prayers now while I can. I'd say goodbye to everyone I love. Because by the time this is over, you guys will end up in prison. And you guys will be kicked off of social media. So good luck. It's over for you.